Let's write a C program to calculate sum and average without using arrays. So here is the concept. I'll ask the user to enter the limit. If user enters 5, I'll ask the user to enter 5 integer numbers. I'll add all those numbers which is equal to sum. To calculate average, we divide the sum by the number of integer numbers entered by the user. So in this case 15 by 5 is 3 which is the average. So let's try that in C programming. So I'll take couple of variables number, limit, I'll take, I'll assign 0 to sum, I'll take a temporary variable and a floating point variable average. So I'll ask the user to enter the limit. That is the number of integer numbers uh, for which he wants the sum and average. So I'll store that inside the address of variable limit. So I'll copy that number to a temporary variable and you will know that uh, you will know why I copied it to a temporary variable shortly. So I'll ask the user to enter the number. So if the limit is 5, he will get a message that enter 5 numbers. Now I'll iterate the while loop until 5 if user enters 5. So I'll decrement the value of limit for each iteration. So inside while loop I'll ask the user to enter the number. So for each while loop uh, the user need to enter a number. So I'll add those things up inside the while loop itself until limit is 0. So I'll take the number add it to sum and store it inside the variable sum and decrement the value of limit until limit is 0. Once the limit is 0 it will exit the loop. So now I'll calculate the average. So sum divided by temp. So the number of integer numbers entered by the user. So that's why I copied the limit value to temp because we are altering the value present inside num inside this while loop. Now I'll just display the sum and average. So we are not using arrays here. So let's check that out. I'll give limit as 5. So I'll enter 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So the sum is 15 and average is 15 divided by 5 which is 3. So it's working. So please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code, notes and explanation about this topic. Stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog without fail. Please share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.